So many people are asking, what happens after a lockdown? And in particular, they're afraid that maybe the lockdown has to last for a very long time, months and months and months. And that turns out not to be the case. And why? The reason is that during the lockdown, the number of cases exponentially decreases, just like it exponentially increased on the way up when we didn't know who was sick and they were infecting anybody that they were in contact with. But on the way down, people are restricted to homes. And the only people that can be infected are the people who live with people who are infected. So what happens is over a two-week period, the people who are infected become symptomatic. And we can identify who they are. It's best if we do it with testing. And once we find out who's infected, the only people who can be infected are the people who are living with the people who are infected. So we know everyone who can be infected and we can isolate them. And so they can't infect other people. This is contact tracing in the context of a lockdown. So once we have everybody isolated who is potentially able to infect someone, the disease really dramatically drops. And as it drops, uh, we get down to a very few number of cases. In fact, in China, it was successful and shown that within two, three weeks, um, it started to decline. And then after four or five weeks, in most of China, it was uh, none. And in the epicenter, it basically took five weeks, maybe six weeks, and it was completely gone. Now, the point is that it doesn't have to start up again, or we don't have to let it for several reasons. Number one, because again, we know everybody who can infect someone. Number two, if there is one case or two cases that we were not aware of, we now are aware of the disease, so doctors are looking for it. We're doing contact tracing. So if they, if they are in touch, if they touch someone, uh, we, we can stop them from infecting others. And this is what was shown in Singapore. A few cases that might show up do not create a major outbreak. We can stop that using contact tracing, which is a standard way of doing disease control.